Thank you, Dr. Clark. I'd just like to say welcome to the 21st year of the Martin Barr Lecture Series. That's really impressive, 21 years. This is just my second attendance, but for Dr. Barr to continue to be engaged with our college is really remarkable. So Marty, thank you. And uh, I have to ask you to stand so that people can recognize you. Uh, considering Dr. Barr's long association with this college and this university, it seems so much awkward for me to say, Marty, please introduce yourself because I've only been here for a year. And people are saying, who are you? <laughs> but anyway, Martin has been just wonderful in terms of, during my past year, in being available for consultations and for sharing of ideas and concerns about this college. Dr. Barr has served, as, uh, has served several terms as dean of this college and continue to participate in the upper echelons of the uh, Wayne State University administration. I believe uh, Dr. Barr was, excuse me, I believe that the first Martin Barr lecture was established by uh, Dr. George Fuller and this was in 1989. And the first presentation was September 27, 1989. So that really is remarkable. I also like to say that um, at, at this point in time, that in, I also need to, to recognize that, that Dr. Fuller, for some of you, most of you know, but not all of you do, has recently passed away, and Dr. Fuller's memorial service and the, and the celebration of his life will occur tomorrow uh, afternoon at 1 o'clock at the, at the Gross Point uh, Memorial Church. I think I had that correctly. And uh, what I would like to do at this point in time is to ask Dr. Abramson to come up and say a few words about Dr. Fuller. And I have to say that uh, I have to make my presentation really brief because Hanley said that he needs about 45 minutes. And uh, I, I, I do have a hearing defi deficit at times, so I said, I'm really pleased that you said five minutes. <laughs> Hanley, please. <laughs> 